Hello and welcome to this short tutorial. To extract texture from an image, first we will need to download this lightweight and free application. I have included a link to it in the description. So click on it and download the software from here. However, do not install it just yet. To run this app, we need to first install another application called Adobe Air. As Shoebox runs on Adobe Air, I have included a link to it in the description as well. So download it along with the Shoebox app. After downloading both application, first install Adobe Air and then Shoebox. Now open the Shoebox application and it will give you this small interface. It has many different tools, but the one that we are interested in is in the bitmap section, which is called Texture Ripper. Simply drag the image from which you want to extract the textures onto the Texture Ripper icon. It will then open a new window where on the right side you will have the image and on the left side you will see the extracted texture. Use the mouse wheel to zoom in and out. And by holding down the mouse wheel, you can pan up, down, and sideways. Suppose we want to extract the texture of this window. Click on one corner of the window and it will create a point there. Now click on the remaining three sides to finish a rectangle. As soon as you finish creating all four points, it will extract the texture and it will automatically fix its perspective. Let's quickly do another one. And as you can see, the application will automatically create space for the other window in the texture map. Now, sometimes you are required to adjust the created texture. As you can see, the texture of this garage door is not symmetrical. So to fix this, simply move the points and it will update the texture after every movement. Sometimes the surfaces might not always be a square or a rectangle, and they might have a bit of curve here. You can fix this by dragging the point in the middle of two corner points. As you can see, I have extracted various different texture from the image. The software does not do a very good job of closely packing the different textures, and as you can see it will leave large empty space. You will have to manually move around each of the shape by holding down the left mouse button to eliminate an used area. Once you are done, click on the Save Texture button. Save it wherever you like. The format will be based on the format of the original image and you cannot change it. That is it for this tutorial. The Shoebox application has a few drawbacks such as there is no button to undo the action. And I wish there is a way to extract circular textures as well instead of just rectangles and squares. Still, this is a useful piece of software if you want to quickly create textures for your 3D environment. Please leave a like and subscribe for more computer graphics tutorials. Thank you for watching.